Hello friends, welcome to my YouTube channel. Today I'll teach you how to display JavaScript alert message box in ASP.NET Core Razor Pages. So let's start. So the very first thing, I'll open Solution Explorer and from there, I'll be opening the Razor page. Now inside the Razor page, first I'll inherit the tag helper classes of the ASP.NET Core. The next thing I'm doing is adding a form. The method attribute I'm setting to post. So here I'm starting by adding a text box. I'm setting the ID for the text box. Now I'm setting the name attribute for the text box. Here the name attribute is very important because on the server side that is inside the index model class, this particular field value will be accessed using the name value or in other words, the name attribute value. Now I'm adding a submit button which will be used to submit the form. I'm making use of input type equal to submit. Now I'm making use of ASP page handler attribute and I'm setting its value as submit. And this particular attribute is used for specifying the handler method. So that's it. Now our form is completed. Now let's move to the index model class. Here I am adding a new handler method. This particular method will be handling the post call and it is accepting a parameter name which will be sent from the client side. Here the case is not important but you need to make sure that the value of the name attribute and the value or in other words the name of the parameter should be same. Now I am creating a view data object and inside the view data object I am setting the value of the name parameters as well as the current date time from the server into it. Before moving ahead, I would like to inform you that an article has already been posted on this topic. The link for the article and the code sample are available in the description. Also, if you need any further help, feel free to ask on forums. The link for the forum is also available in the description. Finally, I would like to request you to please subscribe to my channel and click the bell icon. Now again, let's move back to the Razor page. Now here we need to display the value of the view data. For that, I'll be writing some JavaScript. So first I'm adding a condition to check whether view data has value. Then only this particular JavaScript will render and get executed. Next thing I'm adding script tags. Now inside the script tag, I'll be making use of window.onload event handler. This particular event handler is executed when the page is loaded in browser. Now inside the event handler, I am making use of alert function and using razor syntax, I'll be assigning the value of the view data to the alert function. So that's it. We are done with the programming part. Now we can run the code and see it in action. As you can see, the text box and the button has been rendered. So in the text box, I'll enter my name. Now I'll click on the button. As you can see, my name as well as the current date time from the server is displayed using JavaScript alert message box. With this, we come to the end of this video. Today we learned how to display JavaScript alert message box in ASP.NET Core Razor Pages. Thanks for watching. Please like, share and subscribe and don't forget to click the bell icon. Goodbye.